I used to think that church hurt was a wound that would heal and leave a scar, that eventually everyone gets better, that eventually people with scars helped people with wounds and that everything would turn out okay and live happily ever after or something like that. Lately, I've come to find out that church hurt is a lot more like a latent infection, like herpes or shingles or mono, if you must. <laughs> Once you get it, it's always there. It will go dormant for a long time, and then just like that, any kind of stress will cause a flare-up. And with each flare comes the pain. The flares can be sporadic or recurrent, and each is accompanied with agonizing pain known only to those who have suffered from that same sort of pain. It's been six years. Six years since I first walked out of a church that I loved. Six years since I was finally able to admit that something was terribly wrong at that church. Six years since the pastor, who was my hero at the time, stopped being my hero and my world turned upside down. Six years since I last trusted a church leader. Six years since I've been able to shake that feeling of guardedness that now surfaces every time I walk into a church. Six years since I've been able to tithe without wondering exactly how my hard-earned money would be spent. Six years since I felt safe among God's people. Six years since I've wondered whether God loves them more than he loves me.